What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Hey, sir. Uh, hello, don't I'm Mickey. I'm a fourth year of architecture. I'm Dustin Kendall. I'm a freshman. I'm a sophomore. Hi, my name is Balakoff, and I'm a junior. Great. No I'm Sam. I'm a freshman. Hi, my name is Sam. I'm a junior. Hi, my name is Caroline. I'm a junior. I'm a freshman. Matt Cashin. I'm a freshman. I'm a junior. I'm a sophomore. So, this is Nora Rashid. I'm a graduate student um, in graphic design. I'm originally from Kuwait. The day where you spend with your loved one and the person that you care about the most. I think it symbolizes love and uh, all the years you're with someone and how much you respect them and stuff like that. I guess it's just a time where you've got to get your girlfriend something. Valentine's Day is just a day where you show your love to everybody that you care about. What you should do every day, but just a specified day. Like the family doesn't necessarily have to be somebody you're in a relationship with. Honestly, Valentine's Day started off as like a day celebrating love and all that junk, but now it's just so commercial, everyone buys gifts. What does Valentine's Day mean to you? It means my birthday's coming up, so it's the next day. What does it mean to you? Uh, actually, I don't know, it's um, not, not really much, uh, but it's kind of fun that everyone makes a uh, really big deal about I it. Don't I, I don't really uh, feel like I should give something to my girlfriend because of Valentine's Day. I don't know if it's the same with her, but I hope it is. How do you show love? Hugs, kisses, gifts, money. Uh, it depends on who it is. Like, if my mom went to tell her I love her, if it's like a good friend, I'll tell them I love them. Like, but it can be more than just verbal. Like, I can give them stuff. Um, just show, like, by nonverbal actions, like hugs, kisses. Show love. Uh, I don't know. I try to be nice and uh, sleep with girls. I think that's, that's the way to show your love. Well, caring. I think when you care about something, that action would show it. It's not, um, it's not a card, it's not a flower, it's not um, a box of chocolate. It's how you express those feelings during... Saying I love you doesn't mean much anymore, but living I love you does. Love ever failed you? Hell yeah. Love ever failed you? Yes, on more than one occasion. <laughs> love ever failed you? No, because I've never been in love. Has love ever failed you? Um, no. <laughs> um, honestly, I've been in a lot of relationships before, but I've never like been in love, so I don't think it's ever failed me. I've never gotten dumped. Never failed you? <laughs> yeah, I'll say so. I think it fails everybody at least once. <laughs> love is is more of a sharing feeling that would take. Um, I don't know, take your mind away. You feel you're lost somehow, you lost a track of time and track of place and everything else. Love is, is always on the edge. If you don't feel on the edge, you don't feel that spark, then you're not in love. So yeah, it has its up days, its downs and... Uh, I'd say it's a chemical reaction in your brain. Yeah. Love is a very strong emotion that should not be taken in vain. Love is honestly when you want to live with someone for the rest of your life. You wake up every day, you want to spend every waking moment with them, not because you have to because of marriage or anything like that, but because you honestly want to. What is love? Love is a feeling that you give you that special someone and those who are special around you who care for you and who want your well-being. Um, love is just like affection. It's an emotion. Uh, makes somebody feel happy. What is love? Uh, it's a song by... Hadaway. <laughs> Love song. Boom, boom, boom. I'm not. Don't worry. Ah, uh, dude, that's a good question. I got, I got no idea. And actually, 